Hey guys, what's going on? I just want to take a quick minute today to explain something that is part of our troubleshooting process that is just an absolute foreign concept to a lot of doctors and practitioners out there. Um, in terms of weight loss, most doctors and nutritionists and functional medicine people can look at someone's blood work and say, yep, the hormones are off, right? That doesn't take a lot of skill. Uh, what does take a lot of skill is understanding why, because these patients, they present in two different fashions primarily. They, they, they present in a million different ways, right? But you can kind of bunch most of those million different ways into two sides of the court. Number one, if I start starving myself, like I want to lose weight and I start eating way too little and I do that for way too long, my body's going to freak out and panic and say, I need to conserve energy, right? I need to save as many calories as I can. It does that through limiting hormones, thyroid, sex hormones, a lot of other hormones get depressed in that person in order to make that person, to force that person to spend less energy, okay? There's also a condition where a person simply can't make enough hormone anymore, so their metabolism starts to shrink, but they're eating more food than they can actually handle now that their metabolism is shrinking and they're starting to put on fat. Um, that's another issue as well. Now, those are two completely different causes, right? They need to be handled with two completely different sets of care. The way we would handle patient A versus patient B in those regards are night and day. We would have some of these patients eating more. The first patient I was talking about, we would put them on a reverse dieting scheme. They probably don't need hormones. They still have the ability to make them. Their body's just turned off the switch in order to save energy. So we'll slowly start feeding them more and more and more in a controlled manner and in an intelligent manner just to get their metabolism going again. That's going to get their hormones going again, which is going to get their metabolism going again, which is going to get their hormones going again. It's a cyclical thing. Whereas the second patient I was talking about, they have glandular failure. Their thyroid, for instance, simply cannot make enough thyroid hormone in order to be optimal, or they can't make enough testosterone or growth hormone or whatever that might be. We have to intervene with an actual prescription for that patient. And by the way, all of our prescriptions are almost 100% bioidentical. As far as hormones go, they are 100% bioidentical. We're not putting synthetic garbage into people's body. But if you're not getting the care you need and you feel like your doctor just doesn't understand what's going on or he's not listening to you, give us a call. Our patients love the fact that we listen to them, we explain to them exactly what we see, we explain to them why we're going to ask them to do what we're going to do, and we make them a part of their care because it's their body and their health, and that's just the way we operate. So anyway, guys, I hope this helps you with a little bit with understanding how we come to the table with our diagnosing and prescribing philosophies regarding weight loss. Again, my name is Brandon. I hope to see you guys soon. Have a good day.